close your eyes and watch your breath. Watch it all the way in, all the way out. It's by staying with it that you make a difference. Otherwise, it just becomes part of your trap line. As you check this, check that, you check the breath, you check the weather, you check your apps. It doesn't make much of a difference, but you stay right here. And as the mind has its desire to go out and check the apps, you say, nope, the really important things I need to know are right here, right now. All that stuff outside is just a big distraction. Most people live lives of distraction. And at the end they say, what was that all about? They allowed themselves to be pushed around, like motes of dust in the air. You look at a sunbeam and you see the little motes moving back and forth, and they joggle here and they wiggle there. They go up and they go down and left and right. Don't go any place particular at all. Just because they're so light and they're moved around so easily. We've got to make your mind heavy in a way. In other words, it's not going to be pushed around by anything. Not heavy in the sense that it feels depressed, but simply solid. You're going to stay right here and see what happens as you stay right here. Learn what you can about the mind. Learn what you can about the breath as you stay with the breath coming in, going out. And even though it doesn't have a lot of bells and whistles, there's a lot to be learned here. The forces shaping your life are happening right here. And you want to see them clearly. And the best way to see them clearly is to stay right here. Otherwise, you get pushed off and you don't see any connections. You do something and the results come a little bit down the line, but by the time the results come, you're off someplace else. That's why we stay in ignorance. So if you want to see things clearly, you want to understand yourself clearly, understand what's shaping your world clearly, you've got to stay right here. Make up your mind you're not going to be pushed around. Now we can establish something solid inside and put the mind in a solid direction. As what I said, one of the blessings of life is when you are well self-directed. Make up your mind you're going to go someplace and you go there. You go someplace good. Once you're sure that you're on a good path, stick with it. Don't let anything deflect you. Because where are those deflections coming from? These people who send out messages all the time. Why do they want you to read their message? A lot of the messages we received these days are from people we don't even know. And even the people we do know, they're engaging in their distraction. Why should you let them distract you more? You've got work you've got to do. <laughs>